I got a button. Oh, man. Yeah, you foo foo. I do have foo foo. Big. D. Silver. Well, hello there. So this is uh, day two, I guess, like the first full day of being out here with the Stealth Diggers. And they have a surprise for me that they haven't told me about yet, so that should be interesting. So we've landed at the... Uh, Oh wow, look at this. First sight for the day. There again, doing some digging. Or, I'm just going for the grubs. Show you guys the hole real quick. So this is the cellar hole. And the camera's not going to show it really well, but it goes down probably 10 or 12 feet. I guess. Mm -hmm. Veg the uh, vegetation isn't too bad either, so pretty cool. We're on ground. Yeah. Well. It's got shankage. Yeah. Huh. Probably late 17, early That's 18. Awesome. Very nice. Well, good for you, man. About time, huh? Yeah, well, five buttons so far. We've been here a while. I've already burnt through one snap, so. Oh yeah. Little button. And this one has a shank on it. I don't know, it almost looks like a two piece.
It might have something on it. I'm going to clean it up real quick. See if I can get any detail off of it. Definitely a two-piece. Um, but broken. Cool. Button number two for the day. Site number two for the day, and I have just. Oh, actually, it might not be a heel plate. Oh, it's a shoe buckle. Broken shoe buckle, I think. I don't know, actually. I'll take it. Hey, let me jump in here real quick because that shoe buckle that I dug is actually a pewter shoe buckle. And Charlie dug another piece of it um, at the same site, I think the week before. So he's such a cool guy that he gave me the piece that he dug. And it's gonna go into my display case Awesome. Thank you, Charlie. Over there we have Mr. Keebler. And I have another button. And more, more people coming down the trail. But it has a shank. button with a sun with the sun on it. Huh. Yeah. Yeah, look at more stuff here. Like I said, that little footprint back there we definitely will have to slam. <coughs> oh, square nail. So I had another button signal here and uh, cracked the hole open and I've got a couple pieces of brick, but I've also got some pottery in here. That's cool. Let's see if we can find our button.
Oh, actually, it's not a button. Oh. Well, this is different. Very different. I'm going to have to show this to Charlie because it looks to me like a couple of spoons bent over to make chain link. I don't know. I'll go show him. What I have are a couple of pewter, spoon, or pewter spoons that have been bent over to make chain oh link. Oh, why? I have never seen anything like that ever. Those, that's two spoon handles. Whoa. Pewter spoon handles. Whoa. Fixated. And you found them like this? They were. That's how they were. Yep. I uh, cracked the hole open and there were two bricks in there and a bunch of pottery pieces. Pretty cool. Sounds really good. Let's do some extraction. No, actually ended up being what I believe to be a dandy button. We're gonna wait for Charlie to come over and uh, we'll do the extraction. Oh, it has a shank too. Yeah. Um, might have uh, some uh, fancy on it there. It does around the rim at least. Oh, oh wow. wow, look at that. Uh, whoa. Folks, here's a look at that dandy button. It is in really nice shape. It's got some fancy on it. That is cool. So here we are at the next find is a little drawer pull. Pretty cool. of that. I cannot believe what I just found. This always happens between me and Keebs. I find something, two weeks later he finds it. Well, he found something only a few weeks ago that we'd never seen before, and I just dug one. Well, I got a little piece of something right here. We're not entirely sure what it is, but it's got some fancy on it, and it was right down in here, so cool. in the same hole with shank. Hey everyone, Road Warrior 72 here. That is the end of the video. That is the last video of metal detecting that I have with the Stealth Diggers. I might have one more video that's kind of a thing that I was working on forever for them. Um, if I get that video done, I'll get it up soon. But I just wanted to say huge thanks to Charlie and Jen uh, and Henry and Steven and Wainos. You guys are all awesome. I am hoping that someday I'll be able to make a return trip out to Saskatchewan and be able to dig with the rest of the Stealth Digger crew. I would really love it. 
Um, huge thanks, huge thanks. This was a big deal for me. Um, I tried not to, you know, act super excited uh, while I was out there, but really inside I was just, you know, going crazy because this was, this was a huge deal for me. Um, and everything just kind of conveniently worked out. You know, that week my wife was in Boston and it just worked out. So big thanks again. And uh, Charlie, the spoon is for you. You know why? Just because. Road Warrior 72 out.